In today's video, I'm gonna be cleaning out Sally's pond because she already made a mess in there when I put her food in there. So we're gonna be doing that today. We are also gonna be cleaning out the 20 gallon aquarium where she was at. And that's where the yellow lap is gonna be going, the pregnancy clip. She's gonna be going in there once that's cleaned out and once the heater arrives for that aquarium. So this is the pond. This is what it looks like right now. As you guys can see, it's a little messy from where Sally has been eating and where she has been pooping. She's hidden somewhere in there. I believe that's her right there. But yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and get that cleaned out today. As well as this 20 gallon aquarium, as you guys can see, there's some algae growing right there and it's just it's a little dirty right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and clean it out, have it ready for the yellow lap to go in here once it's ready. And here we have the cichlids. They're just ready for some food. They know I'm about to feed them, so they're getting ready. And right over here, we have the yellow lab. She's the one that's pregnant, and she's the one that's also gonna be going into the 20 gallon aquarium. But I also have to get this one cleaned out because they have been pooping. They've been making a bit of a mess, so I'm gonna feed them real quick, and then I'm going to go ahead and get started on that. Once I do all that, we're gonna go ahead and go to the fish sort, and we're gonna get some little fishes for the pond. That way we can have more movement around. Either minnows, maybe some guppies, mollies, platies, I'm not sure yet. We'll see once we get there. I'm gonna start cleaning the pond. I'm gonna do a quick time lapse so this can go super quick. You said never let me go. cleaner look at that crystal clear and there she is she's hanging by the little rocks up next is going to be the 20 gallon aquarium and after we do that we're going to go ahead and go to the fish store and get those little fish for the little mini pond i'll see you there you said never let me go mostly drained out I'm just gonna go ahead and finish draining it and then take out the gravel and then I'll finish cleaning it off take off that algae that's there and I'll be moving this aquarium to the back room where the pond is all right so we got the aquarium clean and this is what it looks like and there it is it's all cleaned I removed all the gravel and I just put those little decoration pieces there that way she can go hide once she releases the eggs I put those little shells right there in case she wants to put them there but yeah that's that's what it looks like 
And now we're gonna go to the pet store and get those little fishes for the little mini con. I'll see you there. The first fish store didn't have anything, so I'm gonna go to the second one. I'll see you there. I'm back from the fish store and this is what I got. Check it out, guys. I got five little cherry barbs. Check them out, guys. This is gonna look great in the pond. It's gonna add some extra color, much needed color. And I think it's gonna look great. And this is also the other thing that I got. Check it out. I also got some little gold shrimp. I got about 10 of these little guys, and this is gonna be great for the cleanup crew. Any little scraps that Sally leaves or the other fish, they're gonna be there to clean it up. So this is gonna be great. All right, so we're back home. Now it's time to go ahead and let them acclimate. And once they're ready, I will go ahead and release them. We're gonna wait about 30 minutes and then we'll go ahead and release them. All right, so they're done acclimating. Now it's time to go ahead and add them to the meat pond. So the first fish getting at it are going to be the cherry barks. And this right here is what they look like. You can see if I can get it to focus. A little, a little jumpy. And there we go. So the little cherry barks are, they lost a little bit of color because they're stressed, but I'm going to go ahead and add them in super quick. Next up is going to be the ghost shrimp. These guys are going to be a great cleanup crew. I'm going to go ahead and add them close to the rocks so that they can have a little hiding space and can hide from Sally or some of the other fish. You can see the little shrimp right there. They're all kind of just swimming around. Let's see if I can find the little tiger. Let's see if I can find the little cherry barks. They're probably just hiding under the rocks, but they'll probably come out later. Oh, there they are. There's the little barks and the shrimp right next to them. So it's gonna be a great addition to the pond. Hopefully that gets some color going, some more movement. And later on, we'll go ahead and add some more fish. I'll go ahead and do it for this video. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.